CDs are, if anything, kind of falling out, and records are kind of on the uptick. From what I can, from what I can tell. I mean, oh, you got it. I'm Abe. I'm Paul. I'm on town, and uh, we're in Discourage Records in Portland, Oregon, right now. Rare punk specialists. We started this business in sometime in 1994, and we did a lot of mail order. Um, Abe was living in San Francisco at the time, and he was sending us up rare punk that he was uh, rustling up. He was rustling up. He was like the punk detective. We were kind of inspired by the Bloodstains and Killed by Death compilations that were coming out at the time. We just started doing some detective work and calling the bands that were on these compilations, these late 70s, early 80s comps. This happened with the 60s garage bands before us, and there's, there's record detectives for the old jazz and blues 78s. Major labels are starting to notice vinyl again. My contribution is really in, in helping develop the label and um, trying to uncover some, some good stuff. Our, yeah, it's kind our, of a mix of new stuff and reissue. The first one was uh, the Nice Boys. One, the second one was the Maggots, which was a 1970s San Francisco punk band who released a three-song EP uh, called Let's Get Tammy Wynette back in 79. After that was... The Nudity, Nudity. record, yep. and this mm -hmm. is the record that we were just listening to. This, this shop is kind of like such a specialty niche that it's just not affected too much by the recession. I mean, the people that like this stuff are just gonna, you know, probably buy Rare Punk before they eat, you know. Anytime you're in Portland, come to Discourage Records, 1737 Southeast Morrison, and uh, come take a look at our shop. We can send you to other shops in the area that definitely be worth your time. It's, and a, good, it's a good record town in general. There's a lot yeah. of record stores in Portland. Yeah.